Okay, we're gonna have to continue the hippo. A hundred more points. This will be an accelerated episode because I'm gonna win lots of material. I have a feeling. But my opponent's got their own system as well. I don't know how to counter it. I'm just gonna push. Attack the queen. Oof. I'm gonna, I really wanna take that. Ugh, tempting. Just to double the pawns, but we won't, we won't do that. You know, when you move your rooks like this, you can't castle. But if you're playing your parents and they don't know how to play chess, they won't know that. So I've seen lots of people illegally castle. Yeah, Japan is great, uh, Jason. Absolutely. Uh, their socialized medicine. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna castle though. Always play King B1. My bishop is lined up to play e5. It's defended by the knight. A nice discovered attack. Let's grab. It's a nice free piece. Check. I'm threatening bishop a3, king g8, knight e7, forking the king and the queen. Check. Check. My opponent has disconnected, but we'll see. It might be an internet DC as opposed to a, uh, a rage DC. Abandonment, who knows? I think that's the best move though, to leave the computer. Ian Kato. Yep. Has anybody tried playing the hippo? Or just voyeurs? I could see some success. You got smashed? That's, that's fair. I'm not saying you should, uh, yeah, fully transition, but it might be uh, an easy system to learn for both sides to, ha to have in your pocket once in a while. It's castle. Hey, Kanishke, thanks for the prime. Taylor, Zaus, as well. Thank you, thank you. I don't want to take yet because I'm a little worried about the rook lining up with my queen if I open up too much on the d-file. 
The hippo is good against impatient opponents. It is, they're gonna expose pieces. It's kind of like in a movie where in the one army, the guy's like, you know, the leader just like says attack when they're not ready and they get within archer range. That is how the hippo, hippo often plays out if you pay attention to the games. They'll like hang a pawn, they'll throw a knight in without proper uh, coordination and, and just within archer, archer range. Like, yeah. Gonna be some examples of that. Alrighty, let's take. Take back. It's good. See? This is the this is the coverage. Good coverage. Lots of coverage here. I can take I can take on d4 but then d6 falls. So let's not take yet. Oh, that's tempting. I'll start with rook here. Mm. Whoa! That is a very aggressive move. Now the king should be weak. That's a very weakening move. Eventually my bishop will, will reign supreme. Hank Montana and I, I hate potato salad. Thank you for the subs. Good timing. Good timing. Okay, we're gonna give up the bishop. I already have my targets. My opponent's playing well, but I'm gonna attack over here. With my knights. My knights are gonna be aggressive. You finally beat my chestnut combat. I gotta, I gotta do that myself. Oh, is that a free knight? Is that knight within my queen range? It is. My uh, surface-to-air missiles. Is that hanging? It absolutely is. Let's grab that. Is that a free rook? It is. Everything's hanging now. Let's grab that. Let's grab this. And my opponent is dead. Good game. Here we go. Yep. One fianchetto. Two fianchettos. The knights are in. There are the knights. Get the trenches ready. Ooh, okay. And now we transpose to the King's Indian, since yes, we're fluent, fluent there. I kind of like that this opens up my bishop. Uh, castle.
Yeah, I mean, once you get the, the initial moves, you can play it aggressively, passively. I don't mind being a little more aggressive because my opponent's not castled yet. They go bishop e6, I go f5, they, well, we'll grab the piece. The queen's about to get trapped. Not quite yet. Check. I want to go there. Rest in peace, Anya. Spike foo. Good luck. I think we played Spike Flow already. Maybe they have some improvements. What's that? What if I just take this? What if I just take that? Spike Fu is my favorite. Really generous. I just got two free pawns and it strengthens my, my pieces. Sweet. Love it. Go spike. Where's that knight going? White gave me so many free pawns of the knight's trapped because all my pawns cover the escape squares. A real generous lad. Yes, I'm eating very well this game. They don't care about this rook. If, if my opponent doesn't care about that rook, I don't care either. I don't want to win it. I only want to take things that are valuable to my opponents. That are close to heart. What the heck is that? Ah. Learning how to use their bishops. I respect that. Okay. Let's stop that. The spawn's a goner in a moment. We're going to corral it. Didn't have to work for it at all. So I am up eight points according to the chess.com interface. Nine points. Ten points. I'm having fun. Can I convert this into cash? Finally, a patient move. That's a good move. Patient doesn't hang anything. Let's cycle the knights in. If the queen captures g6, we got back rank mate. No? Okay. Push. 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 I'm up 13 points. I like, I like this. 
It reminds me of playing, you know, like Neopets or those MMOs or whatever. Just lots of resources. I'm hoarding. Check. Check. Fourteen points. Check. Nineteen points. Checkmate. There we go. This is the Katranada boiler room. Foxy wizard. Sorry, fox wizard. Okay, no blunders yet. Eric's DJ name is Gay Trinata. Gay Trinata is already gay. pretty decent setup box not overstepping okay we'll go c4 i should castle as well is overstepping sir because i'm gonna take this knight and then take this pawn that was my territory p.m. just warming up I slept in a bit okay I see it. I see that move. Let's move out of the way. Eric's armpits looks like he has two Italian dwarves in a headlock. Two Italian dwarves? Wait. Let me see. How do you come up with that? <laughs> that was... You guys see that? I don't... The Italian dwarves? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna move my knight back. I did my job. Try to win this knight, uh, this bishop. Now we can castle. <laughs> yep, the pit, the pits are out. It's summertime. Um. Okay, we're up a pawn, so it's time to start trading.
Whoa. Okay, okay. Noted. Noted. I, my queen needs to join the game. The queen's doing nothing here. I need to bring the queen in. Ooh, what happens here? Trade. We must. Can I trade everything? I assume I can. Nice. Check. Trade. They played well. They played well that game. Let's go. Seto cast. Quickie. That's a KO for sure. Knight here. I'm playing the hippo for both colors. We're gonna have an aggressive hippo. I'll show you different styles. This one will be aggressive. Next game we'll we'll go passive. Let's go there. I want to open up the G file. Let me find your G spot right here. And the G file is coming. Bishop's also about to say hi. Boom. Check. Grab. Grab. Now we're gonna have the passive hippo. A6, we'll go H6 as well. Don't try this at home. Oh, never mind. They're trying to... I can't play passive because this is very aggressive. I think I have to take. I don't know if I want to allow that. Do we want to allow E6? No. E6 looks annoying. It, it, it's, it's unpleasant. What movie do I like more, The Terminator or Predator? So I grew up watching Predator 2 probably like a hundred times. It was like uh, VHS, Home Alone as a kid. And I just the biggest Danny Glover fan growing up. So for me, wait, is it is it Predator 2? I think that's what it is. Blood, gore, scary stuff. Um, for me, definitely Predator, because that was like the only VHS in that category. And that was a scary one. That was a scary one. Like it was gory, like rated R, you know, nudity, I think, lots of blood. Definitely ter uh, Predator. But I only saw the second. The first one had Arnold, right? Or was it the third one? Uh... So... <laughs> this is a free pawn? You tell me. They overstepped, maybe. 
I'm gonna grab that. Yep. Can I keep grabbing? You can let me grab some more. The Queen's Head Castle. Let me eat that. And then we pull out. Two pawns up. Don't touch my king. For two pawns up, make those uh, pawns... Uh, Make your opponent feel it. All right, let's go knight c6. I just want to trade everything. I did hang a pawn. There's a pawn hanging, but uh, at least I got to trade a bit. So black is up a pawn and there's a better pawn structure. Still like my chances. Sort of trap this bishop. Check. And after king here, bishop b4, how are you going to defend c2? My bishops are saying hi. Okay, okay. Check. Let's grab. I should have just traded rooks. I don't know why I didn't do that. Oh well. This is still completely winning. I just have to make sure I don't blunder checkmate in one. Oh! Don't need to worry about that. Thank you, buddy. Trollman. Hello, hello. I recently rewatched all the Blade movies, like two months ago, I think. Maybe this is a game we'll have a nice passive hippo. Pawn moves. Come at me, bro. I think is the saying here. Come at me, bro. From Ronnie, Jersey Shore. This is a good move, rerouting the night. I like it. All right. Stop it. I'm gonna practice my uh, Technique here. The wall. We got the wall. Let's go. I want to expand anyways. Is this theory? It could be. If you would like it to be theory, it can be done. This is typical hippo stuff. It's 
not easy. It's not easy to break through. I'm serious. This is uh, this is very sturdy. I like my position. We'll see whose king is safer. Okay. If we just trade everything, my king uh, is going to be closer to the center. Ready to gobble. Everything's trading off. It's going to be harder to attack the king if you trade too much. I'm I'm threatening that. Okay, okay, good move. Good move. I'll move back. Let me offer a queen trade under my terms. You take my knight's gonna capture. Could have done it anyways. Okay, okay. Now, let's go here. That's a free pawn. Check. Um, let's go here. I can take this. I can... When you see me the bishop at end of the game, usually... Usually it's a bad sign for the person I'm against. Let me grab that. Enjoy my uh, three pawn advantage. Uh, hippo, hippo speedrun, hippo, hippo, Artemis. Listening to some Kate Renata. Sunday night, weather's nice. Oh, we gotta do some push ups? Okay. Iceberger, thank you for the bits. Got a pump, we got a push, we got a push now. Coronavirus, thanks for the bits. Talk, thanks for the 20 months. The hippo's an opening. I'm just playing a bunch of games. Um, raising the account. Dropping the night.
The Swarm says, sorry about the flames. I was the guy that spotted you at the Dallas game. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> it's, uh, it's tough. It's a tough reality right now. Just doing the hippo. All right, we got everything covered, right? You cannot cross. That's the start, but it's not enough. Because if white doesn't do anything, you gotta come up with a plan. So I'm gonna maybe cross, maybe night. Oh, I'm definitely gonna cross. Now that I went upon, I'm feeling a little, little better about the position. My bishops. Oof. I think I can use some tactics to open this up. And now we're just queenside castle. Bishops and rooks and everything are going to be very happy to see this. All my pieces are coming, coming to say hi. King here, I'm going to go like rook here. And I'll feel good about myself. Nope, you're not allowed to run away. Maybe you are. Check. I'm not going to let him out. Check. That's pinned. That's pinned. So far, so good. Check. Check. Good game. Koopa Troopa. got the anti-hippo in. If I go bishop here, my bishop gets trapped. Tough start. Koopa Troopa's prepared. Let's play h6 in. But this is, this is already annoying. We have some challenges, some difficulties. I am going to take that pawn, Koopa. Because you left it hanging. What the heck is that move? Okay. Are you gonna ran magically queen? No. You don't have the firepower.
That's cute. What did I go here? Uh, respect, respect. We got a sender. Full send by white this game. Check. Check. They're gonna end up with no pieces left, but I respect it. Check. Check. Good effort, Koopa. Babu Suresh. This is for 1400. Okay. Get the knights in. They have a, they have a slower version of the hippo. Because I got my uh, bishops installed first. I'm playing the hippo with both sides, both colors, yes. Now black is just way behind, so I'm going to be ag aggressive. Um, yeah, why not? Try to grab as much space as possible while Black's trying to castle. Looks like a King's Indian. They're, they can get similar positions. We're going to keep pushing. Absolutely. And we're going to grab that. Thank you for the free night. Mm. Let's grab that. Cheers. Now this is hanging. Check. And now I'm threading checkmate. Told ya. Check. There we go. There we go. 1400 done. Not so bad. Thanks for watching an episode of the Hippo Speedrun. If you want to stay up to date with all of our latest content, other speedruns, and future episodes of this, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel.